American diet. One, just another aspect, just another important aspect of lecithin. We've talked about lecithin as a supplement for helping us process fats. Well, lecithin, as it turns out, is also a great source of choline. Would it surprise you if I told you that there's an awesome longevity product that doesn't even have choline on the label, but yet it's a great supplement for helping build up your own natural choline? This is a supplement that we've talked about a lot. It's the longevity supplement. And it doesn't say choline on the label, but there's an ingredient in this supplement that can actually be transformed into choline. We will tell you what that is tomorrow on our next Bright Side episode, so you're going to want to tune in for that. Time to hit our phones. 855-660-4261 is our number. We do have a couple lines open for you. 855-660-4261. Let's go to Pennsylvania and welcome Dolly to the Bright Side. What's going on, Dolly? How you doing? Hi, Ben. Kudos to you. Um, I'm from Pennsylvania. Dolly, I recognize Hi, yeah. you. Good, What's going good, on? good. We you miss never... you. I Thank was so you. surprised, but I'm really happy for the public listening to you, especially. I'm thinking you need shared with everyone. I appreciate and I that, need to, Dolly. When I hang up, I need to get the radio station so in Pennsylvania I can be listening. I appreciate that. You already that, have Dolly. me interested for tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. What's going on I today? I have a problem since you left. Them. Oh, I bet um, I know what your problem is. Yeah, you can't get that cream getting, anymore. Right. Nobody can probably make that. Um, when I saw Dr. Bonji, you know, they gave me a new pharmacist, and when I asked her without giving the list that you, my daughter, who is a little brighter than me, had asked you for the ingredient list, and she had received it from you a time ago, and she says, well, I have that, but of course it doesn't say how to mix the amount. So I didn't give it to anyone, but I asked for their formula, and when I saw it, it was nothing like oh. yours, and I thought... I need to talk to Ben. <laughs> I'll take care of you. You know, I'm starting a new company, a new skincare company here. I've got some legal things, legal hoops i got to jump through first. But uh, you're on my list to call. Both you and your daughter, Michelle, are on my list oh, to call great, first as soon as great. I get set up. Is there anything um, I can help you with today? Well, tell me how long because I'm down to hardly any left in the job. Um, you know what? Why don't you do this, Dolly? Send me an email, ben at ksco.com, and I'm going to send you some complimentary products. I'll, if I have any of that ben other stuff left, at, Ben, ben what? K for King, S for Sam, C for Cat, O for Oscar, KSCO.com. Put your phone number on there, too. I'd like to have I don't think I have it, actually. And I, I think I owe Michelle a call, by the way. I don't think I called her back. But in any case, send your, put your phone number, put your address, and then I'll give you a call uh, maybe later today or tomorrow, and we'll figure something out. I'll get you some Okay, stuff. make sure I have that right. Ben, K, S, C, O. No, no, Ben, at, Ben, ben at, K, S, C, O, dot com. Okay, Ben okay. at KSCO.com. We'll Correct. do. Okay. Thanks so much, Thanks Dolly. So Keep much. listening to the program because I'll be making announcements about my new skincare stuff here in the coming days and weeks. Okay. Well, what, do, what radio station do I tune in from Pennsylvania? To you know, you? I don't know. I'll look into it, and when you send me an email, I'll respond back to you. Great, great. Thanks, Dolly. Hey, guys, good to hear from you. Ben. You're so good, Ben. Thanks. Thank you. God bless. That's awesome. I know I know Dolly from my from my other career. As a skincare pharmacist, and for those of you who have inquired about my skincare products, hopefully I'll be uh, as soon as I get through my my legal stuff. Uh, hopefully we'll have some other some products coming out, and we'll, we'll be telling telling you more about that in the coming days and weeks. Okay, five five six six zero forty two sixty one. Let's uh, head to Michigan and welcome James to the bright side. What's up, James? How you doing, buddy? Hello, Ben. Hey, James. Um, my mother is eighty three years old. Oh wow! Awesome. Very active. Nice. And as far as I'm concerned, she's in good health. Okay. She just reported to me that her she went to the doctor for a checkup. Okay. The doctor says that her kidneys are only performing at 15%. Really? And she didn't know that? No, she didn't, did not that's, know that. That's interesting because that's kidney failure. 15% is, uh, is considered kidney failure. There's different stages of kidney disease, uh, and they base it on how well your kidney filters stuff out. If it's at 15%, you're looking at kidney failure, and that's pretty severe. They didn't say anything about dialysis or anything? Not yet. Hmm. I was just curious as there... Uh, you, sure she didn't say 50, you sure she didn't say 50%, 5 zero? Because that's more typical. Less than 15 or less is pretty serious. And I... I, I yeah, I think I, I'm quite sure she said 15. Well, I get it. I would get a second opinion. 
I would be getting a second opinion. She's certainly wise to be worried about. It. That's pretty severe stuff. That's that's uh, that's that's kidney failure, as I say. So a couple things. Uh, when you got when your kidneys are messed up, you just need more of the same things that everybody needs, and that's potassium and calcium and phosphorus and protein. Got to watch out a little bit more carefully with your sodium, uh, but you just need the basics, but just more of them, and it's more imperative. Now, if she's 83 years old and she's doing well, she's probably she's probably taking care of something because at the age of 83, most of us are falling apart pretty good. So if she's out there uh, exercising and walking around, and she looks she appears to be fine and feels healthy at the age of 83. I would say she's probably doing a good job and. I don't really, I don't understand how she could have, she could be in kidney failure and not know it. In any case, get her on the Ultimate Daily. Make sure that she's using the entire Healthy Start Pack, and that's the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, the Ultimate EFAs, and the Osteo FX. Um, you want to get her, make sure she's got a good source of protein. Whey protein is going to be the best. Uh, uh, but if she has a problem with whey, she's going to have to go over to hemp seed protein, which is the second best source of protein. She may also want to try egg protein, which is also a good source of protein, as long as she can eat eggs. And uh, let me think a couple other things for you here real quick, and then I'll let you continue. If she can do legumes, those are also good sources of protein. Uh, and then the electrolytes. Vegetable juice is also a great source of electrolytes. Uh, have her get a Vitamix and make her own vegetable juices. She can also, if she doesn't want to go out and get a Vitamix, she can use a regular juicer, but she's going to miss the fiber. Uh, uh, Vitamix allows you to keep the fiber. And have her doing vegetable waters. Vegetable waters are a little different from vegetable juices in the sense that a vegetable water just has a couple pieces of cucumber uh, dissolved or, or mixed in with some water as opposed to a juice, which is just the pure vegetable. So if using vegetable waters, vegetable juices, those are also great sources of electrolytes. In addition to the Healthy Start Pack and the Ultimate Daily, hang tight. We'll finish up when we come back from our break. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You are listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. We'll be back right after this. Don't go away. everybody, Jason Lewis here with another great idea from JasonLewisTeam.com. Now, how would you like an energy drink that's actually good for you? That's right, one that not only gives you an afternoon pick-me-up, but that's loaded with the most important antioxidants for reducing the damage from stress. It's called Pollen Burst, and it's a natural burst of energy that lasts for hours. Now, most energy drinks rely on a massive dose of caffeine, sugar, or even vitamin B. Pollen Burst takes a more balanced approach, and that's why I like it. I also love the fact that Pollen Burst has plenty of vitamin D and green tea extract. This is the best energy drink I've ever tried. So trust me, you'll not only like it better than the others, you'll love the way it's individually packaged for freshness as well. They've got these on-the-go stick packs. They're great. Pollen Burst. It's available at JasonLewisTeam.com or simply call 1-855-310-TEAM. For a natural burst of energy, it's Pollen Burst at JasonLewisTeam.com or 1-855-310-TEAM. So we decided to upgrade the look of our home. You know, improve the curb appeal. We decided to add the look of stone to the exterior. We really like the stacked stone look. Yeah, but when I checked into the price, it was ridiculous. No way could we afford it. Then a friend told me about Genstone. G-E-N-S-T-O-N-E. Genstone comes in lightweight panels made of polyurethane. They've actually engineered the hassle out of installation. No mortar, no mesh. It was easy. Even I could do it. We just screwed the panels to the wall and it looks like stone. Stone. I mean, it really looks like stone. Yeah, from the box to the wall in minutes. We love the look of our home now. And Genstone is durable, comes with a 25-year warranty, and offers additional R-value for insulation. If you want the look of stone at a price you can afford, call Genstone. At 855-955-STONE. Trust me, you'll save money. And you'll love the look. 855-955-STONE. That's 855-955-7866. Don't complain about your cable bill going up and up and up. Do something about it. Grab a pencil and jot down this special number. 1-855-905-MY-TV. The more cable TV rates go up, the better digital satellite TV looks. Say goodbye to the cable guy and get more of your favorite channels in 100% digital quality for less money. Call 1-855-905-MY-TV. Sign up for packages starting as low as $19.99 and there's no equipment to buy. You get free HDTV upgrade, a free DVR upgrade, and free professional and 
installation. You control what you watch when you watch it. Record your favorite shows. Pause and rewind live TV. Even skip the commercials. Watch local channels, too. At just $19.99, what are you waiting for? Pull out your major credit or debit card. Call 1-855-905-MYTV. 1-855-905-MYTV. Say goodbye to the cable guy. Cut costs and get more. 1-855-905-MYTV. 1-855-905-MYTV. It's hard to imagine when things are going reasonably well, just how quickly things can change. But what would it take? Economic collapse? Massive crop failure? Chemical or biological attack? So many situations could find you in the grocery looking to pick up food for your family only to find that the shelves are empty. There's nothing. Don't let that happen. Act today to make sure that if it ever comes to that, you and your family will be provided for. Visit FreezeDryGuy.com to look at the wide variety of survival foods available. Freeze-dried foods from the Freeze-Dry Guy store longer, rehydrate faster, are nutritionally superior to, and taste better than any other long-term storage food available. Visit FreezeDryGuy.com or call toll-free 866 404 FreezeDryGuy.com Independently leading the way for the nation. Compelling talk for every political persuasion. We are Cheese. For you guys living in the Arkansas area, I'll be doing a talk in Hot Springs Village, Arkansas, just outside Little Rock on Friday, May the 9th. That's a week from this Friday. And then if you're in the Indianapolis area, that's for Pete Greenway, by the way. Uh, and then uh, if you're in the Indianapolis area, I'm going to be doing a talk for my friend Richard Stocks on Thursday, May the 22nd. On May the 9th in Hot Springs, I'll be with Dr. Wallach. And I think we're trying to set up a little uh, uh, interview where I talk to Dr. Wallach about, uh, about his book, Epigenetics. Instead of just doing a presentation, I'll be doing a presentation with Dr. Wallach on stage interviewing, with, interviewing him about his book, Epigenetics. It's not 100% sure yet. We're still trying to work out the details of that. In any case, I will definitely be in Hot Springs, Arkansas on May the 9th and in Indianapolis on May the 22nd. If you're in the area, hope we get to see you. Okay, James in Michigan, continuing on with kidney issues. Uh, James says his mom was diagnosed with kidney failure. They didn't, did they call it kidney failure? They just said she had less than a 15% filtration rate. Well, she didn't exactly call it kidney failure, but of course I, I, I naturally knew it was a kidney I, failure. That's pretty much officially kidney failure at 15% filtration. In any case, uh, Ultimate Daily, uh, Healthy Start Pack, make sure she's getting enough protein. You want to be a little bit careful of phosphorus. Uh, a lot of foods contain phosphorus, especially dairy can be a source of high phosphorus. And there's also phosphorus uh, food additives. Phosphorus is one of the most important food additives or one of the most prevalent food additives. And look for phosphates or phosph- uh, phosphorus or phosphates. Or they come in various terms uh, on your ingredient deck. Uh, when you're using processed food, probably just best to stay away from processed food, actually. But if you are going to use processed food, look on the ingredient deck for the word phosphorus or phosphates, and those are kind of, those are foods that you're going to want to stay fr- stay away from. If you have a kidney problem, you may not be eliminating phosphorus as effectively, and that can cause problems. So uh, stay away from uh, uh, processed foods. Dairy, uh, nuts, and beans can also be sources of phosphorus as well as uh, perhaps beer, if she's a beer drinker, which I doubt. That can be also a source of phosphorus. So, Anyway, that's just for just FYI. Anything else, James? Um, oh, I was thinking about eggs. She does eat eggs. Eggs uh, are great. If she can handle eggs, make sure she can handle them, though. A lot of times we think we can handle them, but we end up with uh, digestive health issues. But it doesn't sound like she's got any, any health problems, so eggs probably a good source of protein for her. Protein is very important for everybody, especially if she's especially for elderly folks. Uh, frail folks, post-surgery, pre-surgery, these are, all, uh, these are all groups of folks who need more protein, and you don't want to skimp on her protein as long as she has no problems processing it. Got to move on, James, Any, uh, unless, unless you have something real quick for us. What's that? What Yarrow tea is good. Yarrow tea is good. All, all herbal teas are good, and the great sources of electrolytes, as long as she can handle it. It could be a good, uh, it could be a good beverage for her. Thanks so much for your call, buddy. Appreciate it. Moving on to Ron in Texas. Welcome to the Bright Side, my friend. What's going on? Is this me? Did, this is did you. Did you get me? 
You're you and I'm me, as far as I know. Anyway, Ron. Hey, hey, hey Ben, I, I'm, I'm 80 years old now, and I've, I've been speaking to you for about roughly a year. I'm in really great shape, and awesome. uh, I uh, take supplements, and I do the right things. The trouble I've had since, age, since approximately age 77 is a drop in my libido. Okay. I just don't get erections anymore, and uh, uh, I can't ejaculate. I mean, just... Okay. Well, these are part and, par- part and parcel with the aging process. Your blood pressure is okay and, and blood fats and cholesterol and all that stuff. You yeah. had that checked, yeah. I take it? Okay. That's you, and no diabetes or anything?